Hey guys, Dr. Koshik here at Clear Choice LASIK Center and Cleveland Eye Clinic. Uh, I want to tell you something. A lot of patients basically come up to me uh, when they're having laser vision correction evaluations and they say, hey doc, have you had uh, vision correction yourself or are you wearing contacts right now? And as a patient uh, who has worn contacts for many years since I was a teenager, glasses since I was 10 years old, I've been waiting to have a procedure to get me out of contacts in daily use. And, you know, a lot of patients don't even realize how many refractive surgeons have had laser vision correction on themselves. I think just in our center, upwards of about 10 docs have had uh, either LASIK or uh, some other type of laser vision correction on their own eyes. Obviously, we believe in what we do, and uh, you know, I think uh, refractive surgeons are the highest percentage of all doctors having refractive surgery because we see it all day long. We see what it can do, and uh, so after being in the field, you just want to have it for your own eyes to have that freedom from glasses and contacts. Uh, so I'm really excited uh, to finally get out of these contacts, finally stop wearing glasses, waking up in the morning and searching for them. Uh, and I'm actually having uh, the Evo ICL done in both my eyes. Um, I'm a pretty high myope, uh, so I'm very nearsighted. And so when I wake up in the morning, uh, life is a blur. To have that ability to just wake up and immediately see crystal clear and not have to deal with anything is gonna be life-changing. So I'm very excited uh, to start this next chapter of glasses and contacts independence uh, and join a lot of the other doctors here who have had this done. I think this is going to be a great experience to be able to actually truly relate to the patient as they go through the journey. Um, I'll have a really good uh, appreciation for how they feel pre-op, how they feel, you know, you know, physically at, the, at this moment, uh, what's running through their head. Um, and, and hopefully, you know, once I'm in the OR, I'll have a better idea also of the sensations, the, the sights and everything uh, from a patient's point of view. So I think that's going to help a lot. Um, and hopefully I'll be able to put my patients at ease a little bit more um, by explaining to them the process in maybe a little more uh, intimate detail. How's it going? It's How going well. I feel good. <laughs> yeah. A little different on this side. Yeah. I know. I was just saying I've, yeah. I'll be able to really relate to, to our patients and, yeah. and get it from that point of view. Yeah. So I'm excited. Cool. What we're doing today is the implantable contact lens. So more or less we're taking a contact lens prescription, putting it inside the eye for permanent uh, vision, but it is uh, removable if we ever need to, but we don't expect that. Uh, and uh, more or less just like wearing a contact lens on the outside of the eye, visually, however, it's inside the eye. So you don't see it, you don't feel it, but you get that same vision correction. So yeah. we'll walk you through it and we're gonna do all Excellent, I'm really excited. So uh, Dr. Bill Wiley here with Dr. Koshik and we're about to do his implantable contact lens surgery. I've got the contact lens here. You'll see it on the screen. And this is what is basically the same prescription as he has for his contact lens for his eye correction. Two small incisions to allow for fluid to go inside the eye. Here's numbing that goes inside the eye. New lens going in. Nice and smooth. Now it's putting it into position. Tucking it behind the iris. So we got the lens in, it's all perfect. I you just using some fluid to clean the uh, lens? You did awesome. That was perfect, like textbook. Thank you. That wasn't too bad, was it? No. We just did Dr. Koshik's first eye for his implantable contact lens. And more or less what the contact lens is, is contact lens prescription, instead of being on the surface of the eye, it's going internal inside the eye to correct his vision. It's almost immediate vision effect, so he'll have very fast vision recovery. We expect the vision to be very, uh, very good, very clean, um, and the results uh, heal quickly. We'll, we'll proceed with the second eye. So Dr. Koshik, what do you think about the uh, MKO melt? Oh, it's, I think it's treating really well. So we're using uh, anesthesia that's called MKO melt. <clears throat> Actually, we helped develop it, and it basically has uh, Versed and uh, ketamine, and it does a great job to kind of get you in a good place. 
This is the lens going in. The lens going in there. Just about done. Okay, so awesome. you did awesome. Thank you, thank you. You're welcome. Went really, really smooth. That's great. Yeah, we'll bring him across the hall, check his vision, and see how he's doing. Hey guys, I just had ICL surgery on both eyes. Probably just about four minutes ago, I just got rolled out of the OR. I'm sitting here and recovering, have my Scooby snacks, and uh, I can already see everybody's faces around me crystal clear. This is remarkable, uh, you know, for such a high prescription that I had and also being just like, like I said, four or five minutes after, after surgery. It's amazing. So I'm, I'm really happy. Uh, O-F-L-C-T. P-C-T-A-B. A-P-E-O-T. Wow. Dude, that's awesome. <laughs> that's awesome. We just finished uh, implantable contact lens, both eyes, with Dr. Koshik. He is under the influence of uh, anesthesia a little bit, so we'll see how he's doing. <laughs> doing great. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, it was pretty amazing. Dr. Koshik was able to see a little bit better than 2020, which we typically don't expect that this soon. But uh, he also might be, he kind of knows a lot of the letters on the chart. So maybe his brain already knows what they're supposed to be. But anyways, we were about uh, an hour after surgery. We did an implantable contact lens. Uh, today, Dr. Koshik was doing, you know, cataract surgery and lens surgery himself. And then at the end of the day, he said, okay, I'm going to get my eyes done. And so we did an implantable contact lens, both eyes. Uh, and there's, uh, you know, each procedure has its nuance. Uh, but based on Dr. Koshik's prescription, he had, uh, had a high prescription. Uh, and sometimes on some of the higher prescriptions, we don't want to remove as much tissue, tissue. And so by placing a contact lens in, inside the eye, we can allow for this quick vision recovery without removal of tissue. And then, you know, let's say sometime in the future, if ever need be, we can remove the contact lens. And at that point, he could have, let's say, other procedures. Ultimately, when his eyes age enough, he might have cataracts. And when that occurs, we'll remove the cataract, remove the implantable contact lens, and have a whole new lens that goes in its place. So anyways, Great procedure. Uh, the newest version is called the Star Evo ICL. Uh, we've had great results, and it's great to have Dr. Koshik uh, go through the procedure. So, what do you think on your perspective? I thought it was uh, quick, painless. You know, it went by in a flash. Uh, it was nice to get an idea from the patient's perspective about you know the things that they're going to be experiencing and and going through that process with them. But honestly, by the time I got into the operating room with with you, I. I really do not recall any moment of pain, discomfort, irritation, just a little bit of bright light and, uh, and then it was over. It was just such a smooth experience, yeah.